They wanted to know why you have this flag here. You know, you know what this flag means? Come on here. Anytime there's a situation, it's very easy for me to know that I can bring the flag together. No photo. No. Put it down. Photo. We just want to know I'm why you have I'm talking to you. Put it down. I have the right to use my phone. You don't have the right. It's private property here. It's a private here. Okay, well then don't invite me here. I do what I like. The red and blue flag being shown on the screen is called the Confederate flag. I said a tourist shop in Camden, one of the most multicultural places in London. As you just witnessed, we wanted to find out if the shopkeeper knew anything about the flag. Better yet, is the public aware of this flag's presence? Had a coffee, had a coffee. Hello, I'm Marissa. And I'm Kyle, we're from Fully Focused Youth Media Production Team. We're out in Camden today to talk to people about the Confederate flag and how they feel about it. Yeah. Um, do you know much about the Confederate flag? Oh, no, not really, no. Oh, how do you feel about the Confederate oh, flag? Oh, it's lovely. Four, four, four. It's lovely? Yeah. Do you know about it? No, I don't know about my wife, love it. that's why I came here. Oh no, the Confederate flag was... <laughs> oh yeah. Bruh. Man, man ain't no KKK, or KKK, I don't care about the KKK, K? Yeah, I'm not too sure anything about the flag and what's going on. I don't really know much about it. Not really. No. No, I don't. Do you recognise the flag? There's other people out there, you know? I don't know what I think of the flag. Really? Oh! What comes to your mind when, when you see this flag? 2 Hazard, to be fair. Um, it used to be in the Dukes of Hazard. It seems like not a lot of people know about the flag, so here's a brief history lesson. This here is the Confederate flag, used in the American Civil War, also known as the Confederate Battle Flag, was used in 1863. This flag should be more accurately be referred to as the battle flag for Northern Virginia. This is the first and original Confederate flag. The flag has strong ties to racial injustice and slavery that extend far beyond the Civil War. Though some people may genuinely feel that the flag represents their Southern heritage, the reality is that in far more recent history, the flag has been used as an explicit symbol of racism and inequality. All right, now we know what the flag represents. Let's see what the public thinks of it this time. Oh, I know about the Confederate flag. Oh, I thought that shit is some bullshit though, so. To me personally, it's just for country and western music. I don't see it as being a racist flag, although it does stem back into the day, but while I like country and western, it's just a flag to me. It doesn't mean anything. When I look at the Confederate flag, I want to throw up. It's a symbol of oppression. There is no positive feelings I have towards it, put it that way. So how would they feel if they knew that this flag in question is being flown in Camden High Street? I think it's stupid. I didn't know it was there in the first place, but it's idiotic. I can't stand it. The fact that the guy has run the shop for so long in such a diverse area for people from absolutely everywhere, it's just disgusting and it's just, it's distasteful really. Considering the attention it's got in the press recently, I don't think there's much of a basis that they can really defend themselves against it um, because it's been widely disputed as a racist flag. Um, do you like ice cream? I love ice cream. Would you give me a high five? Yeah. Are you a racist? Yeah. Hell no, the no, no, no. First image that comes into my mind is General Lee. It's KKK, like the racism, racism in general. Due to our efforts and raising awareness, not long after talking to the shopkeeper, the flag was taken down. We learned today that um, the flag means a lot of different things to a lot of different people. We learned there's just not one answer. The conversations that we had were very valuable. So please subscribe if you like and like and leave some comments on what you think. We're fully focused, youth production media team. Ah! Punk America, Mark. Thank you. Got nowhere to stay. 
just a concrete floor, no bed where my head can lay. Moving around all the time, my journey is a tour, reaching from the dark, looking up, falling from afar.